Ho ho ho! Hello, Pokey Dudes and the Pokey Dudettes. Um, welcome to what we're gonna do. What we're gonna do actually is sort of like what we did last year, but we're actually gonna build special Minecrafters in. Well, Christmassy type of form. So if they've already got Christmas skin, we'll do that. And if they don't, then we'll find a source of one. So we're gonna call this Christmas skins that you build. Now this will be laid back for the last ten days of this countdown. So, well, I'm gonna go myself in. So what we're gonna do is we're basically just gonna grab a super flat world, and choose a Christmassy one. Snowy Kingdom, use that preset there, press done, and press done again, and uh, we'll set up the world, and uh, start up by um, building Santa Claus, because it's Christmas and we've got to stop somewhere. So on my, so on the bit you cannot see, um, I'm on a image of a Santa Claus skin. I'm not gonna make it exactly like that. I am gonna go off the boundaries just a little, just to give it a bit more of a 3D feel, so we can get a, a better look. There I am. Uh, my skin. My my jumper actually takes itself off actually do that I can just take off the jacket the left sleeve and right sleeve and I will actually be in a shirt I forgot to turn the bottom, top top off so um let me just pop them back on there we are and so what we're gonna do is gonna start by looking at the pixels of the thingy. So, for the look of the feet, they're about four pixels. So what we're going to do is that um, some of the shoes are black, so we're going to grab some pink black, so that black wool, we'll stop the black wool, and we're going to place down one, two, three, four, Build this boundary. Like so. Do, do, do. And then we're gonna build up from there. This will be the first shoe of the first leg, and then we can make a mirrored version right next to it. Good and just finish off here. Do, do, do. There we go. And then what we'll do next to it is the exact same thing. Issues. That's never good. Perfect. And then we go to the white wall as we go for the next part. There we are. And then it gives us a layer of just white. Do 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 do. Oh, I'll put that one later. Good. 
go, and boom. Then we'll build a, another layer here, just to sort things up. I was terrible, terrible at the adventure maps, so I managed to break them. So I'm gonna just lay off the last couple of days just to build some YouTubers or some Minecraft people that you would enjoy. So once we've done that, we need to build the legs. So we're gonna get my favourite colour and bring in a nice red, which is right there. Nicely done, and uh, let's see. Um, how much does the Minecraft leg go up? So about 14. If it's not proportionate, then we'll just... So about 10 more. One, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Too much, then we'll change it. But what I can tell, this seems alright. Yeah, that should do fine. Alright, so I'm gonna come back once this is all filled out and sorted, and I'll get back to you in a sec. There we go, the legs are done. For reference, I've used snow. As here you can see, a couple of layers of snow is exactly proportionate to my legs. As snow is, for one layer, is about two pixels. So putting a bunch of layers together, you can show suit and try and get it. I also use a zombie for measurement as well, just to get a perfect size, which actually helped. So, yay. Alright, uh, next we have to do the top half of the bottom half of the body. So, according to this skin, it goes a layer of two layers of white, which is what we'll do. You notice, like with my skin, it also goes with a bit of white on it as my. 
my character is my Minecraft character is based off of Red from Pokemon Fire Red Leaf Green, just with a sort of Christmassy vibe for the Christmas season. And this is where my skin comes in handy too. And it also goes with a line from the two middle points. Oh wait, no, this is wrong. Well, the one I'm... <laughs> Let's spice things up a little bit. And... Use proportions to advantage. We're not going to make sense of that. But what we'll do instead... Is we'll do a black belt. Like most... Santa's are drawn with. We'll make the belt one pixel long. With a gold buckle. Which we can get by actually... Oh god, this mouse has been a pain in the... Next time we'll actually get a gold block for the belt. Boom and boom. And then we get and then we'll do the two layers of white. One and a two. Sorted like so. <sighs> Alright, um we'll just continue building. There we go. Bottom layer. Oops, don't want that to actually happen. this point we use the belt earlier to build what comes up from the middle point. Now if I remember correctly, if I can get a big zoom on my skin, this top piece. Right, arms and waist are exactly the same. Apart from mine comes a block out. Not even a block out. <laughs> so what we'll do here is we need to count how many points it is higher. Let me just set the time and day back together. This is where we'll use this again. Okay, so we know that these work from there. And if you notice, it also goes up a bit on my character's board. So back to the zombie. to get back here. Is that much? Yeah, let's continue. Oh, fucking! So we've gone up at least four layers here. So um, according to this, it goes 
Alright, 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 so if we start on the hands as well, which we'll do in green, for his nice green gloves, we'll use a nice light green here, we can get the hands in started, hands are about the exact same as the legs, four green, And according to this, they go free up. Mine go two up. Like so, we'll do the other arm in a minute. And then they go for an some white the two layers if we can get the arms correct then we can get the rest of the body right so there we go there's one arm from there it goes one One layer, two, three, four, so one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like the legs. So I'll just finish off this arm and we'll, well, I'll finish off both arms and I'll be right back. Poke dudes and poke dude. All right, um, we've got somewhere. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna fill up the body with red. I've also done the middle straight away to get that out of the way so we can finish this as fast as possible. Because I don't think you will want to stand here and wait for me to finish this. So I'm just gonna speed through this bit as well. Basically all we're doing is filling in the rest of the body with a nice lot of red. No hollow. And now we skip through. See you in a bit. Alright, as you can see, the body is done. So from there we have to make the head. The head. My head isn't that great. Actually, this bit is the hardest, I believe. If I remember correctly, the head is just a square. It's a cube head. So what we can do is we can take a head out of the bit here, uh, where is it, Ch -ch -ch. miscellaneous, no, decorations, there we go, we'll grab a regular head for reference, and we'll pop it right here for now. As you can see, it has pretty much enough to help us build it up. We'll start with the classic sand beard. So from this, and according to this, I don't think the head's going to the shoulders. Oh god. Okay, so the head goes into the shoulders, but how much in and out? So we use this and 
use the white wall here, so the shoulders and uh, the beard should help us with this, no problem. It's been a while since I last actually built an actual Minecraft skin. Santa's beard first. Like so. Right, we're gonna need um, some pink wool here, get rid of the glass, the snow, and the zombie spawn. We're gonna need some pink, um, also nice. There we go, we have a white... How does the white stained? Is it sort of a skin colour? <laughs> yeah, it is. Well, let's use this, this stained clay. Good thing they added that recently. What we'll use for the mouth is the pink. That's not good. Fixed. Right, the eyes are going to be a bit of a problem. Except we have... <sighs> we have quartz by our side now. So we can use the quartz as well. To give us a nice eye colour. We can remove the head, we don't need that anymore. And we can grab some, where is it, there is some coal, and we can make the eyes, using this bit of skin here, on that bit of skin, just like a sideboard at the moment, there you go, there's the eyes, and then just fill that in with the white stained clay, and hey presto, you have a good Santa face, now from here we'll just build his head up from the forehead and then we'll have to make um we'll have to make his hat up is the exact same. Okie doke. There we 
almost finished with Santa Claus and then we can move on. There we are. I'll just finish up with then we have to go for the ear, which is a one, two, a one, a two, a three. They remove this bit, the skin, which connects up here, and then the white returns to here, as that joins the hat. Why except these two bits, which are actually skin coloured? Same here. And we'll continue with the white. Get some red there. Just gotta finish off by filling it off, which I'll do now. Alright, now that we've done that, we're just gonna finish off by filling in the last bits with red. We just need to check one thing the darkness of the red. Because. something a little bit different for a certain part of the hat. I'll just finish off there until we get to that point which is here where I've got the red stained clay for a little bit of an extra help here. As we go boom, boom, Finished if my mouse and computer don't be in a blue and there. It's been such a pain to work with. Hopefully, things will be a little bit better in the future. And now for the last layer. Oh 
Okie dunk. Jiminy Cricket. Okay, there we go. We have finished Santa Claus. So now we'll just do a bit of a tour around him. But wait, we're not finished yet. We are missing his glorious beard. Which we'll quickly do now, actually. <laughs> And there we have a Santa Claus, as jolly as ever. Join us next time as we build what in the little word didn't manage to, a snow creeper. So I'll see you guys next time.